condos, condo dwellers and their dogs. And their dog walking, fan, you know, dog walking all the time. And there we have it. That is basically most of Ontario Place. What remains of Ontario Place, or Trillium Park as they now call it. And uh, I'm gonna keep filming. Because why not? Why not keep filming? Is that, that Asian guy over there with his coffee, he wants me to keep filming. Why wouldn't he? I don't know how much memory I have on this, but I keep going until my memory runs out or the power runs out. And uh, I'm just gonna go along the waterfront. That guy on Family Guy, the guy in the wheelchair. Let's do this! Let's do this! Now that sounded kind of wimpy. It's more like, let's do this! Let's do this! So maybe in the future I'll explore the exhibition. That's the Prince's Gates there, which uh, is one entrance to the X. When I say the X, I mean the Royal Canadian Exhibition. And by the way, all of the land which I'm biking over right now, all of this land is landfill. So this would have been open water over a, I don't know, in le definitely in the late 19th century, I believe this was still all open water, and then probably by the 20s, this would have, would have been filled in, or even earlier. Ugly chairs, ugly color, yellow and red off. Just painted white. Okay. Now, now we get into the really, uh, really densely populated section of the waterfront. Gotta get past these people. Come on. Have an electric bike. It's kind of nice. Whoa! Whoa! 
Watch out, man. Watch out. Be careful, be careful. Well, that car came a little close. A little too close for comfort, man. See, what's cool about my bike is I can see my speed limit. See, I'm 26 kilometers an hour right now. It doesn't get much beyond 30 kilometers an hour, though. It doesn't matter how hard you, you pedal, it's like, it's not gonna... You'll just be pedaling and won't be doing much, basically. So you can't, you can't get it beyond 30 kilometers an hour. So many signs, so much signage here. Basically, use your own discretion, watch out. Assume that motorists aren't gonna see you. Assume that they're just gonna go. You know, just use your discretion, but don't, don't wait in a line if you don't have to be waiting in a line. Don't stop if you don't have to be stopping. My goodness, I'm not advocating anyone to do anything dangerous. I'm just saying, use your own discretion, use your common sense. This is way too much signage down here. Very safe people. This is safe people central. Nothing wrong with wearing a helmet. I'm just saying, you know, safe personalities. We're passing the downtown financial core over there. Whoa, man. What a mess that would be if I hit that guy. <laughs> like, oh man, that would be a huge... That wouldn't be nice for me or for him. But uh, yeah, he'd go flying down to the ground. That would not be nice. Uh, skate park here. S skateboarders. It doesn't matter if you got a skateboard, rollerblades. You're not going to move anywhere as fast as you will if you have a bike. I mean, if you have a car, fine, then that's faster. But uh, but actually, in the downtown core, a bike is actually often faster than a car because the car is too too big. It gets stuck in traffic, and you can go around them. So, uh, uh oh, run, run for your life. Uh oh, uh oh. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. It's Caribbean man. All right. Okay, now we're basically escaping the, uh, the very densely populated area, which is nice. Over, don't run me over, don't run me over. Whoa.
wonder what they're building there. I don't know. I mean, uh, who knows what they're building there? I don't know. I mean, uh, that's a big mystery. I really wonder what they're building right there. going ship the federal sakura oh looks like it's loading something on there loading something through the red patch refinery where my grandpa used to work and i wonder if that's something to do with the sugar making process it's kind of a cool ship kind of like a medium-sized ship it's not like one of those huge freighters, but uh, definitely ocean-going ship. But I feel like it would have to take measures if, if it was going through a big storm. Like, they might want to delay or speed up because it's not the biggest size of ship. It's a bit, you know, medium-sized, so it's still an impressive ship. This is uh, Sugar Beach, I believe it's called. Sugar Beach. They made all the... These are permanent umbrellas, which is kind of nice. But they made them uh, pink. Pink because everyone in here has to be a little... go back to the road. I wouldn't want to live down here. Not at all. Not at all. I'm gonna go up the Don Valley because I think that's just more practical, more practical. Beautiful day. Get off your bike. See, this is why you can't you can't really take the signage too seriously. Take it with a grain of salt. Use your common sense. Use your street smarts. Stay alert. I know all the best ways to go. I know all the shortcuts.
here. Oh, dear me, dear me, dear me. Oh, dear me, dear me. I'm not going to take the waterfront back. I'm going to take a different way home. Okay, so we're now heading up the Dawn Valley. It's a Dawn River there, very disgusting river. See, the guy who just passed me up ahead, he's what I would call a sports cyclist. They wear the aerodynamic, tight-fitting clothing. They always have to be going very, very fast. Like, I'm going I'm going pretty fast too, but they, they honestly go even faster than I do when I have, you know, full energy available. And uh, I just like to make fun of those guys because they're not chill. They're not chill at all. Like, they wear helmets. They, they wear all the equipment, but then they, they bike so fast around tight corners. They're the sorts of people that blow by you and they're like, on your left, on your right, on your left. It's just like too much, man, too much. You gotta relax, you gotta enjoy. You'll never see them biking at night. You only see them biking in the day.
feeling amazing, amazing feeling. Not so cynical about the city right now. Feeling amazing, amazing feeling. Excuse me, people on the train. Where are you going? Where are you going? I don't know. Uh, uh, where the train going? Whoa! Alright folks, I think I think this is a good place to end. Because you know, more valley, more trees, it's nice. I think you get the idea. I don't even know if my camera is still filming. We'll see. Well friends, hope you enjoyed that. I had a nice ride myself, speeding through the downtown waterfronts from Ontario Place 
and then up the Don Valley. Hasta luego amigos!